This is a summary video which is going to focus on all the different techniques that you can use to separate substances and focusing on which technique you should use in different situations. So a simple way to determine which technique you should use is to do some sort of flow diagram. So the one that I'm currently writing at the moment starts off with do you have an ink or dye that you need to separate? Nine times out of ten, if not more, this is going to be chromatography. If it's not chromatography, the next step to go on to is do you have a solid or liquid? If that's the case, for example in rock salt, your usual step is to go down the filtration, sometimes crystallization route. The final step is if you've got two or more than two soluble liquids. And what I'd suggest here is if you've got two soluble liquids, go with simple distillation. And if you've got three soluble liquids, go with fractional distillation. OK, now that we've gone through the different techniques available, I've provided links to the videos which go through those techniques in a bit more detail. What I'd like you to do is make sure that you're familiar with them before you move on to the next section of the video. OK, let's have a look at an example question then. So this question is, name the techniques which are suitable for separating the following mixtures. You have five different ones where you're looking for five different techniques. So A, to obtain drinking water from muddy water. B, to separate petrol from crude oil. C, to remove leaves from a swimming pool. D, to obtain pure sugar from a solution. And E, to determine whether the colouring in a fruit juice is a single substance or a mixture of coloured substances. So take a minute, pause the video and see if you can come up with the answer to each of them. And if you're not sure, go back to the previous videos, go back to the links and double check. OK, you should have uh, had a go at the question by now. Let's have a look at the answers. So A, if you want to obtain drinking water from muddy water, the best technique there is simple distillation. So that will be one mark. To separate petrol from crude oil, where you've got a mixture of different substances, your best one there is fractional distillation. If you want to remove leaves from a swimming pool, filtration. To obtain pure sugar from solution, that's crystallization. And then finally, to determine whether the colouring in a fruit juice is a single substance or a mixture of coloured substances, that is chromatography. Hopefully this video has helped. If you're feeling confident enough, have a go at the review section which is, you are asked to separate sand and sodium chloride. Name the separation techniques needed to carry out the procedure for two marks, and then explain how you would carry out the procedure to obtain both pure sand and sodium chloride from the mixture. And that concludes this video.